Morning everyone. As you can see, we are in the Hakey V3 this morning and uh, we're in the middle of an orchard looking for field fairs, gold crest, um, and anything else that comes along. I mentioned field fairs and gold crest because I've been in this orchard um, specking it out yesterday and uh, that's what I saw. There were flocks of field fairs in here eating on the apples and um, I saw, I don't know, maybe five, six gold crests within the space of probably about an hour. So uh, I thought we'd come back this morning and um, check it out and see what we can find. So yeah, we'll see what it's um, what it's like as the day goes on. It's just gone nine o'clock. It's a very wet, grey, miserable day. Um, no sunlight around. So I'll uh, I'll give you a look at the um, settings we're using, and I'll uh, I'll give you a bit of a a view of what I can see from the hokey. But yeah, hopefully you can hear there's plenty of bird life around. I'm hopeful that we'll get something on, the, on one of these amazing trees that are in front of us all dropping down and um, you know having a feed on the apples so it was it was quite a difficult decision trying to think where to put the hokey if I'm honest um, but I put it here simply because I saw one of the gold crests um, feeding on two of the trees that I can see from here and also we've got a good line of sight of the um, of the apples, so I thought it'd be a good spot. So we're on the um, on the Z6 with the uh, the signal 150 to 600. Um, Going to be uh, difficult to uh, get any shots with with any kind of lie a low um, ISO today, just simply because of the light. But we'll have a little play about and see what settings we can get and. Um, Hopefully we'll get some good shots. This is the view straight out ahead of me. We've got some fantastic lums. And trees, which hopefully something will come and land on. But yeah, absolutely beautiful. What you can't see is out of my left hand side, um, about probably 50 yards away, there's a woodland. There's a lot of uh, bird life going on in there at the moment. It's uh, as of yet not coming down this way. That's okay, it's early days. The other area is going to be of interest this area of apples down here so if I zoom in we'll be able to see what we get apologies if this gets a bit jumpy we're right in it 600. I think that's still pretty acceptable. Lots of lovely rotten apples. This is what the field fairs were uh, very excited about last weekend. And they were all over it. So as I mentioned, I came here yesterday to set things up and um, position the hide. So that's been up here since yesterday. 
and it absolutely hoofed it down last night. I mean, proper, proper rain. And it was very windy as well. It was a sort of, you know, gale force weather warning out. And um, yeah, this morning it was absolutely dry as a bone inside. Um, so that was fantastic. The, the only water that, uh, that got in this morning was my fault. I didn't um, shake the hide off properly before I got in, so when I zipped it open to get in, there was a load of water that was on the uh, on the hide. Got in, but uh, literally just got a cloth and wiped it up, you know, nothing, nothing major. So I was really impressed with that, I was absolutely dry as a bone inside. Guys, we've got a green woodpecker. 